All right, well, hello there. It is Sunday, uh, Sunday, October 22nd, and it is 8.30 in the morning. Uh, so last night after the Saturday night sale, I went to bed. I, I didn't organize the table. Um, I just went to bed. So we are starting fresh, talking about Saturday and Sunday today. Um, so the uh, Saturday night sale with uh, Gina, Southern Siren Vintage, uh, that was a lot of fun. And I hope if you um, weren't able to join us that you do watch on the replay. Uh, we had a blast. And uh, I hope Gina, who is going to a antique mall sale, um, is having great success this morning. Um, so we bring 20 items to the sale. Um, I brought, let's see, I brought two items that were choice. So that gives me a count of 22 items. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I sold eight of 22 items. Um... And so we're going to go over what sold, what's still available. Just want to remind everyone that I am now doing giveaways. Um, so uh, be sure and watch my videos, leave a comment. So every time you watch a vlog, leave a comment. Uh, when you watch one of my lives, go back at the end, um, either if you're with us to the end right afterwards or go back the next day, leave a comment. And on my shorts, uh, leave a comment on my shorts. Um, all of those get entered into giveaways. Um, I know I need to get my list. I will, on Monday's live, Monday morning live, I'll do my best to remember, make a mental note, to uh, announce the winners. On Friday nights, we're doing the drawing. So uh, join us on Friday nights and watch us do the drawings. It's a fun little race. It's a, it's a randomizer. It's a race. Um, but uh, I also do a member's appreciation drawing on Friday nights, so everybody who is a member gets entered into that drawing. And um, yeah, so be sure and leave a comment. Also, um, I will be doing a bigger giveaway every time we get a hundred people into the chat. So you just have to get a hundred people in the chat and then we will do a giveaway. That's weird, I thought I saw, I guess that's a leaf or maybe that's a bird. I almost thought that that was like someone's pet out in the yard. I guess that's part of the leaf. Um, so yeah, so tell all your friends, sign into all your devices, um, get a hundred people in the chat and I will be doing a big, bigger, uh, giveaway. So that is still standing any live, any live. So my morning lives, my evening lives, my Saturday night lives, get a hundred people in the chat. I will do a giveaway. And every time we hit a hundred, so you guys know I do sales Monday through Friday, um, and Saturday. So if we get a hundred people in the chat every single time, I will do a giveaway every single time. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, all right. So the eight items that I sold, uh, yesterday, let's go through or Saturday night. Let's go through those so camera around. So these, uh, Edward Curtis, uh, they are reprints of his original, uh, photographs. Uh, this one was a single. This one was sold as a pack. That's an awesome grouping. Um, he photographed Native Americans from like 1898 to, well, well into the 20s. So it was like a 30 year span. Um, so yeah, they are fabulous, fabulous photo collection. So uh, those are five by sevens. And then I had a lot of 11 of these glass stars. These are so cool. There were six of these large ones and five of the little ones. 
Uh, this was a fun wood panel. So they are all hinged together and there are nine different Santas here. And they're um, painted on both sides. Uh, this was from Scotland and it is a thistle salt and pepper set and you have the little thistle tray or you could use that as a spoon rest. Uh, this clear cloche, um, really thick glass dome, really nicely made, kind of a candle wick design around here. Uh, the see no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil, and apparently there is a fourth one that's kind of a touch no evil. <laughs> so that set, and then this is a gorgeous East Germany nutcracker and so he sold all right uh, so what items are still available well we've got the avon angels this is a beautiful set from 1983 porcelain angels from avon and they were twelve dollars uh, we've got the waterford crystal uh, they are the Millennium Angels. They came out in 1998. This one is Fellowship. You can see the little Fellowship across there. This one is Generosity. And those are $20 each. And the ornaments are about three inches tall on those. Uh, this is a fun light up bell. Uh, so the way it is right now, it has a uh, colored lights here, uh, clear lights here. There is a flashing bulb right here, um, but you can arrange them however you want. Take the clear out, have it all colored, take the flasher out, have it not flash. Um, it is a fairly recent plug. Let me get that out. I did have a question about the plug. So here is the plug for it and that was $15 uh, the ginger jar this is a Toyo Japan probably from the late 70s tropical orchid and it has a couple of butterflies and it does have some crazing on it and that was $15 uh, the vase uh, this is a um, artisan made blown glass vase. It does have, let me see if I can get a darker, darker background. There is a signature and a date right there. It does say 1990. Here is the bottom. It is smoothed and polished. And then the design. Uh, so this is not painted on. This is actually inserted and melded into the glass but it is this beautiful yellow design the vase is about five inches tall and that is fifteen dollars uh, also fifteen dollars each are the tunisia bowl and plate um, it does say back here that they are Food, dishwasher, oven, and microwave safe, safe. They are made in Tunisia. Thick pottery um, bowl and plate, and they are $15 each. Uh, this is $12. It is a Haviland. Oops. Johann Haviland, Bavaria, Germany. Um, a cream soup bowl and underplate, gorgeous cobalt and blue design, and that is $12 for the set. Um, I've got the cutting board here with the horse or zebra. This was made in Thailand. It is about 17 inches long. Um, really almost too pretty to use as a cutting board, but this would be an awesome serving tray. You could put all kinds of appetizers, desserts out on here. The handle is screwed in on the back, so you actually can use the handle um, to help carry it. It's very secure on there. That is $20. Uh, 
uh, the Fenton Aqua Crest vase. Uh, this is in beautiful condition, no chips or cracks at all on the extra crimpy ruffle on there. And that one is, I think it's about four inches tall. Uh, that is $20. This is a, um, a tea light holder. So it has red on top, red glass, uh, amber, a purplish pink, and then uh, the green. And then right in there is the tea light and you access it right back here. So really easy to use. Uh, that is $12. Uh, the match, match holder, a little cardboard Santa. This was made in Japan. And it did have 40. A couple of them are missing. The very long fireplace um, matches. That was $10. And it was about 12 inches tall. And then we have the Harry and David uh, cookie jar. So let me see if I, I'll get my camera in here. This is the Frosty Ice Cream it has an ice cream on top. You lift the top and there is a popsicle in the bottom. And this is an awesome cookie jar, like an old uh, delivery truck in that beautiful yellow and aqua, very lustry. And that is $40. All right, I'm gonna switch the camera around all right, so that is everything from the Saturday night sale. Uh, I am caught up on my computer work. So I did that yesterday. I got all caught up. I did an online um, auction yesterday. And while it was kind of in between the lots I was watching, um, I was able to kind of organize the counter so I'm gonna flip this around again. Um, so this is where I did my <laughs> Goodwill haul and everything is kind of kind of out here. Plus I've added to um, the stacks. Uh, so what I have done, um, again, while I was kind of in between auctions is I organized things. So pretty much this stuff is going to be, you're getting a preview. This stuff is going to be the Monday sale. Um, I've got the Monday evening sale I do with Jen kind of over here. Um, Tuesday sale. I'm still kind of working on a bit of Tuesday sale, but it is going to include, oh, I think this is going to be kind of the Tuesday morning lunchtime sale. And then this, I think, is going to be the Wednesday morning sale. So, um, yeah, I'm kind of, kind of a little organized with what I'm going to be bringing to the sales uh, because I need to get this counter cleared off uh, because I have last week's estate sale that I still need to unpack. Plus, I'm going to be going on Monday and picking up another estate sale lot smaller smaller than last week's um, but still uh, I'm gonna need some counter space so this will be the best way to uh, clear up some counter space um, plus I've got more of these uh, fun crafting scissors I'm gonna incorporate into uh, some more of these sales uh, I also have a whole bunch of Christmas um, that I'm going to be working on sorting. So now that I have kind of the base of my um, sale Monday, two sales on Monday, my Wednesday sale, and at least part, nope, Thursday, Tuesday, <laughs> two sales. I'm going to start that again. Two sales on Monday, the Tuesday sale, the morning sale on Wednesday, and then, um, and then we'll see what, what else, but I've got, got some more Christmas stuff that I'm going to be incorporating into these. Um, so 
that every time I kind of have that every time I come downstairs for something, I need to like grab a little something, you know, these little five minute projects. Let's get the little five minute projects done. Um, so that's what I'm kind of working on now. Like today, I'm going to be going up packing and invoicing all day long. So kind of every time I come down, if it's to feed the cats, if it's to feed me, if it's to bring down packages um, so that they're ready to go for um, for shipping. Um, that's kind of what I'm going to be doing. Grabbing a little Christmas, getting it organized, incorporating it in. And uh, yeah, yeah. So kind of on top of things. So um, let's see, what else do I need to tell you about? I think that is pretty much going to do it. Um, yeah. And then we'll see what happens. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to go ahead and we'll see. I might upload this later today. So if you want to watch it today, great. If you want to watch it on Monday, super. But, um, but yeah, I don't think, I don't think I'm going to have then a separate vlog for Monday. So that's kind of where we're at now. So, um, oh, I know what I need to include. The thing, the additional things that sold. All right. So hang on. I'm going to grab those and I will be right back. All right. So it's been about another hour <laughs> since I first started the vlog. Uh, it's about 930 now, but I do have the table, I think, cleared off. Yes. Uh, so the table is cleared off. I have pulled the items um, that have sold after the sales. Uh, so I'll show those items. And a couple of the items from last night's sale, I uh, shot shorts for real quick. So um, so they're, they're beautiful items. I think they will make really fun shorts. So I did that really quick um, to be uploaded at some point. Maybe today, um, maybe later in the week, <laughs> but I will get those um, at some point up. And uh, so let's turn the camera around. And so after the sale, yep, what I just talked about, the match uh, Santa match holder, that sold. Uh, this is a little porcelain angel ornament. This is a little bear with a gold bow. And then uh, Jessica Rabbit from Who Framed Roger Rabbit. So she's been doing some Christmas shopping. She's got her bags. And so those are um, additional sales after the sale. Um, all right. So I think to uh, wrap up the vlog for today. So I will get this uploaded a little later in the afternoon. So you can see that. And then, yeah, watch for my shorts, watch, um, watch the video, go back, watch the live. Don't forget to leave comments um, so you can be entered into the giveaway. And thank you so much for watching, and I will see you on Monday.